We'll await further news for now, Richard. Thank you. Scientists at the CERN Nuclear Research Center in Switzerland have succeeded today in producing record-breaking high-energy particle collisions. The Large Hadron Collider was uh, designed to replicate conditions seen shortly after the Big Bang. It broke down, though, soon after it was switched on in 2008. Well, now they hope the study will bring new insights into the nature of the cosmos and how it all came into being. Well, let's get more from our science correspondent, Palad Ghosh, who joins me. Um, just explain something of what's been going on and how things are looking at the moment. Well, for the, first, uh, uh, for the past hour and 20 minutes, science has been crashing particles together harder than they've ever been crashed together before. Seven times harder than any particle accelerator before it. Now, that's important because this is what the Large Hadron Collider was designed to do, to recreate the conditions, as you said, that occurred similar to the, at the beginning of the Big Bang. Now, the particles are being accelerated along a 27-kilometre long tunnel, deep underground. They're being accelerated at speeds close to the speed of light. And when the particles crash together, they're smashed into even smaller particles. Now, because they're being hit together so hard, scientists hope to be able to create and see particles they've never seen before. And they believe that these are the particles that will help them learn more about how the universe was created and how it will behave enormously complex. Uh, when are we going to sort of learn what they found? It is enormously complex. That's why they need to carry out billions of these collisions in, in order to get any meaningful data. So it's likely to be years rather than months before they start rolling back some of the frontiers of physics. Gosh, all right, Palo. Thank you very much. Thank you.